News in Chula Vista this morning where two people are now dead after a wrong way crash on the five around three o'clock this morning. CBS 8's Alex Lai is near the scene. She's been reporting on the story all morning long. She's here with what we've learned so far. Yeah, so the freeway actually reopened at around 830 this morning. Now this is part of the I-5 southbound near the Palomar Street exit, and it was completely closed since the collision happened at around 320 this morning. Take a look at what happened. So CHP confirmed with us it was a two vehicle crash with one car driving the wrong way. CHP said there was one occupant in each vehicle, and they both unfortunately died on the scene. One vehicle was a red Honda. We're told there was a female inside by CHP officer Mendez, but we have no other information on their identity. Now we saw firefighters cut open parts of the car to extricate the body this morning and then tow the car and pick up debris left over. Now the other car involved since this was a, a two vehicle collision was a Dodge. It was left under the Palomar exit sign. That car had caught on fire during the collision and was engulfed in flames. Uh, unfortunately, that occupant died as well, and we have no information on their identity. Now, when we got to the scene, uh, the car was completely burnt and was pretty far away from the red Honda underneath that sign. After assessments from CHP, the coroner and firefighters, that car was removed and the area was cleared as well. Then after this, crews began to leave and CHP started their cleanup. They had to sweep the highway and clear debris from the road before it could be open and finally cleared out at around 8.30 a.m. Now this all started when CHP got calls of a wrong way driver starting at Camina de la Plaza. Then the crash was reported at 3.20 a.m. So to recap, the freeway is now open. Again, this happened on part of the I-5 southbound near the Palomar Street exit in Chula Vista. But um, as you can hear, the highway is now open and uh, going as usual, but it did cause quite a bit of traffic this morning. Uh, and just to recap again, it was a two vehicle collision with a wrong way driver. Unfortunately, both of the people involved are dead. And that's the latest in Chula Vista. Alex Lai, CBS 8.